Nymphomaniac comes from the ancient Greek creatures, nymphs. Nymphs were nature spirits who liked to hang around in the water or woods, and they were super, super horny. They even had a habit of chasing after guys who visited the woods just to get their sexual fill. One of the juicier nymph-based stories has to do with the water nymph, Salmasis, who wanted the handsome hero hermaphroditus so bad, she physically merged her body with his. Yep, Hermaphroditus became half man, half woman because a water nymphomaniac just needed to get laid. And she even came up with the term hermaphrodite in the process. But you're on the definition page for nymphomaniac. So, nymphomaniac is a sex-obsessed woman. Got it? However, fellas, there's also a term out there for you too. Satyriasis. See, satyrs were also particularly lustful creatures of Greek mythology who were men with the physical characteristics of a goat or of a horse. These guys had a sex drive so high, they had a penchant of getting caught in situations involving attempted rape. A lot. But the gods weren't happy about it, and uh, neither are we. Not acceptable now, not acceptable then. Well. If we've learned anything today, we now know that the ancient Greeks were a pretty kinky bunch.